Hey girl, hey, welcome back to my channel. As y'all can see by the thumbnail, today we are back again with another wig tutorial. Today we will be working with Genius Wigs. So y'all, I'm about to do a little unboxing so y'all can see what this wig comes with. This is the box right here, super duper nice. It says, be creative, be stylish. Once you open the wig up, it comes with an edge brush, two caps, a lace scarf, and it comes with two lace bands so you can lower your edges. Also, it comes with a clip. And they also sent me a little handwritten letter, which was so, so cute. A company has never did this for me. So again, thank you, Genius Hair, for that. Also, y'all, this is crystal lace. It's not brown lace. So I want to show y'all the difference of crystal lace, brown lace, and transparent lace. So I also do want to show y'all the packaging that the wig came in. It came in this clear packaging right here, and it just has the details of the wigs. This wig is 18 inches. It's 180 density, and it is a 13 by 6 lace deep cap. So I do want to show y'all the wig, y'all. Super duper um, nice. This wig already came pre-plugged, pre-bleached. I didn't have to do anything to it. So this is a very um, friendly friendly wig if you're not used to installing um lace wigs by yourself y'all just look how nice this wig is it's pre-plugged pre-bleach the hairline is just perfect you don't have to do anything to it y'all and it matches your scent scone so well because it has like this red undertone to it y'all can obviously see that the knots are very very small it kind of mimics your scalp super duper nice the hair is super duper soft it has like a kinky straight texture but this is also a very versatile wig you also can um, wet this wig and it'll have like a wet and wavy texture so yeah this is how the unit looks again i did not pluck this unit i did not bleach this unit this is how the unit comes right off the pack and it is an 18 inches so this is how the unit looks look how soft this hair looks and i love how it's thick all the way through the unit i am going to take the wig off the cap just so y'all can see the structure of the wig and y'all look how nice and deep that part is the parting is just bomb like look at all that parting space like this is super duper nice um it does come with a built-in elastic band so you can make sure it fits your head size i did get a medium sized cap but they do offer small caps and larger caps if your head is bigger than mine it also comes with clips in the back so you can secure it super duper um nice but first i'm going to show y'all the difference between the crystal lace uh, transparent lace is the crystal lace this is the brown lace and this is the transparent lace when you have them side by side you can already tell the difference like the crystal lace the knots are just more seamless and it just looks more natural i am going to place all three of this on my skin with some glue so y'all can tell the difference so i'm going to just take some regular gatsby glue spray spray and then i'm going to take the gatsby glue wet spray i'm just going to spray a little bit on my forearm and i'm first i'm going to lay the um transparent lace on there and that's how it look y'all that's the transparent lace i let that dry right beside it i'm going to lay the brown lace and with the brown lace i can already tell it it's a little thicker transparent lace to me is a little more um unclockable than the brown lace y'all can clearly see the difference and then the unit that i'm going to be showing y'all today is the crystal lace and i'm going to lay that on last and this is how the crystal lake look look like okay y'all i don't even have to say anything you can clearly see the difference the crystal lace is more see-through it's more adorable it's just it just looks way better than the other two again the brown lace you can clearly see is not giving scalp and then the hd lace it's not the transparent hd lace it's not bad but it's just not i don't know y'all it's just not giving the crystal lace it's just i don't know it's just giving scalp and it just looks more natural i don't know y'all so look so i'm gonna bring one two three so i'm gonna bring okay one two so i'm gonna bring it up a little bit just so y'all can clearly see uh the difference between the lace and i'm gonna spray a little more glue on there so y'all can see how it takes to the glue look at that y'all you could barely see the crystal lace wow wow
Okay, now that y'all have seen the difference between the crystal lace, the transparent lace, and the brown lace, I'm going to go ahead and unsolve this unit, tie my hair down, braid my hair down, and I'm going to go ahead and try on this wig, and I'll be right okay, back. Okay, y'all, this is how the unit looks straight out the box. Really natural. I didn't place any glue on it, and the lace is already blending in with my skin. I did want to point out that it is ear to ear. A lot of units don't go ear to ear. I have really deep sideburns, so I really admire that about this unit, and I really like how it mimics a natural hairline so I'm gonna go ahead and install this unit using my got to be glue and my got to be glue spray spray Okay, y'all, after I took that elastic band off the hairline, I was shook. Like, this unit is laid. It's giving scalp. Super duper natural looking. I like how the hair has this, like, shine to it. I didn't add any products or anything to it. It just looks really, really natural. Um, and for that, I decided not to do any baby hairs for this look. I was kind of trying to decide if I wanted to do a middle part, a side part, or just a throwback. Um, I did decide to do a middle part, but like I mentioned, 
mentioned earlier, this is a very versatile unit. So I wanted to show y'all how it looks if I wet it. It's like a wet and wavy look. And I wanted to show y'all how it came, the blown out look. And y'all, I'm literally dipping the hair in a cup of water. And immediately it starts to curl up and mimic natural hair. I really, really like that about this unit. Okay, y'all can clearly see the pattern on the right side of the unit now that I have it completely drenched in water. And it's really, really cute. It's like this wavy type of look. I like it, but I decided that I wanted to style my unit in a kinky straight, like blown out look. So I am going to revert the unit back to kinky. And yes, because I get a lot of questions on previous kinky straight wigs that I would feature in my videos. Y'all ask, can you curl it? Can you straighten it? Does it go back to its original state? And yes, this unit does go back to its original state. It took me about five minutes just to um, blow dry the hair out and it went back to its natural state. Okay, y'all, so this is pretty much the finished look. I put some big body curls in this unit. I filled my brows in and I added a little lip and this is it. I just love how natural it looks. I love how full it looks. Um, I would definitely recommend this unit if you like natural textured hair. Um, this unit was really, really flowy. You can do like a side part. You can do a middle part. You can do like a throwback look like i don't know y'all the hair was really really soft it took well to a curl and i did wear this style out so the curl the hair did hold a curl pretty well um yeah but this is pretty much the finish um look don't forget to like comment and subscribe and all the information on this unit will be listed down below and i'll see y'all in my next video peace